Okay, someone asked how to create a deeper, positive, energetic relationship with money. I'll start by saying everything comes down to identity. Do you believe that abundance in the form of money is possible for you at the level that you desire it? You see, not long ago, I was broke as a joke. And I kept having this conversation with myself, which is why am I so dope in all these other areas, but when it comes to money and finances, it won't fit. Right? And what I had to do was dig down and do the work of getting supported and coached and held in the trauma and shame that lied underneath all of the work that I was doing. You see, I was almighty and all powerful in the ayahuasca ceremonies. I was tapped in and tuned in in the meditation world. I was tapped in and tuned in in the transformation world, but none of those spaces challenged me to look at the identity that I had taken on as a child of being the dumb friend, the stupid one, the underdog, the person that was less than everybody else. You see, that had followed me. Even though I, I, I got a bigger body and I grew up and I looked like a man, that nine-year-old, that eight-year-old, that 11-year-old consciousness was still in the way. And so if you want a more lucrative, beautiful, powerful, energetic relationship with money, one of the first places to start is looking at whether you actually believe you can. What are your subconscious and conscious thoughts around you and money? What are the conversations you have around money when it comes to success? What did that equal in your household? Was money a subject that made your parents fight? Was your father or mother stating things like money is the root of all evil? Because if they were, then those are gas break in your consciousness. And the work is to just be gas. The work is to say, hey, this money isn't mine to keep. This car isn't mine to keep. I will steward it. I will hold it. I will play with it for now. But just like the G.I. Joe or the Ninja Turtle or the, the, the black sweater I had on, you know, 10 years ago, those things came through, but they don't belong to me. We don't get to take any of this with us. So the game is to open ourselves up, to open our channel, right? If you can open your channel to an iPhone 13 or 38, you can open your channel to $130,000. That's the work.